Oh, thank you, please. Now, uh, you can take this book back to the shelf. Ah, okay, thank you. Yes, sir, sir. Uh, as you saw, I only spoke and water came. I didn't have to go by myself. I sent a word and the word brought water. I sent the book back to the shelves. I didn't carry it personally. But I spoke and the word took it back to the shelves. This is how powerful words are. Do you know for people to date, someone must speak. I mean, it does not pass through osmosis. You can't just get closer and then pass through osmosis. No matter how much you feel for each other, someone has to speak for it to come to a reality. That people now form a whole family out of a statement. Words are so powerful and sometimes we use words carelessly, taking the careless weight. Do you know what you keep speaking gets registered in your subconscious mind? And one day it will become a reality. If someone keeps telling you, I will beat you, it's a matter of time. One day they will execute it subconsciously without planning. In fact, it will happen by reflex. Most tragic family violence started by sudden statements. If you interview those people, they will tell you, he started telling me this and it later came to pass. Most people who committed suicide started making certain statements that people took lightly and it came to pass. Many children have become unruly, not because they were so from birth, but because they were labeled by their parents or the people around them. If you keep calling your child a fool, you are a fool. One day, they will prove you right. They will behave the way you call them. If you keep telling them negative words, one day the negative words will become a reality. If you keep telling your daughters you are dressing like a prostitute, you may think you are correcting them, but that labeling may affect them dearly in the future and you may not like it. Don't speak negative words to children. They can end up living the reality. Don't accept funny nicknames. As people keep calling you that way, subconsciously you start acting that way. So funny nicknames, names that could not even are very wrong, but people laugh around and enjoy them endlessly. Don't accept nicknames. Don't call children nicknames. Don't brand them names of wicked people. It is not right. You can label them wrongly. Speaking is free. You don't need to buy airtime to speak. And so when you're speaking to yourself, ensure you speak positive words. If you keep speaking positive words, they are building. They are even building your faith as you keep speaking them. And one day they become a reality. Now that you don't pay anything, and now that you don't address anyone, you're only addressing yourself and speaking to yourself. Speak positive statements. Speak big things into your life. Sometimes they may sound like they're an insult to your intelligence, but keep speaking them because those are the things you want in your life. Sometimes it may repel with your conscience, but keep speaking it because that is what you want. Words are seeds, so ensure you sow the right seeds. Speak what you want, it will come to pass one day.